I'm in the Brant Hills neighborhood in Burlington and right behind me is the Ireland house. Now this house was built in 1835 and is one of the oldest settling residents of Burlington, Joseph Ireland. Now his family uh, donated this house to the city of Burlington and now they run it as a museum. It's a very cool place to come if you've never been here before. Um, a lot of school trips come to this house so it's a very neat place because it talks about the history of Burlington and how it, it came to be and, and why this house is so poignant in the neighborhood. Now the Brant Hills neighborhood is a great neighborhood northeast, sorry, northwest Burlington. It is Highway 5 Dundas Street to the north, Brant Street to the west, Guelph Line to the east and Upper Middle Road to the south. Branton Hills was established in the late 70s, uh, mid 80s, and the neighborhood boasts a lot of single family detached homes. There's a creek that runs through it, which is uh, always beautiful, and uh, the neighborhood still does have a lot of trees as well. Now, the reason why it's called Brant Hills is because it is the hilliest part of Burlington. Paired along with Tyandega, which is just west of it, these two communities are the hilliest in the whole city. When you're at the top of Brant Hills, coming down into the city, down Brant Street or down um, Highway 5, you can actually see all of the community and on a very clear day you can see all the way to Toronto. It's a very, very neat view. Houses in, in Brant Hills are very family oriented and there's some great shopping centers in the area as well.